So you've just clicked on this video right now because you're really interested in Black Ops Cold War and Warzone. Like, how is are these two games going to be mixing together? In this video, I'm going to be telling you guys exactly how, and I'm actually going to be telling you guys that you've already played the Warzone for Black Ops Cold War. So let's get straight into this video. So if you've been playing Modern Warfare and you've been playing Warzone, you've been having a blast, well, guess what? It's going to be staying around the same kind of pace. So when Black Ops Cold War does eventually drop, um, it's basically, they're going to be putting everything from Black Ops Cold War into Warzone, but not the other way around. So you know Black Ops is nice, it's it's a nice quick pace, and Modern Warfare is slightly toned down, slightly slower. But unfortunately, we will be keeping with that slower pace with inside of this new game. So basically, when this game does drop, they're going to be putting in the Black Ops Cold War weapons into Warzone, but they're not going to be putting the Warzone into Black Ops Cold War. Kind of. Because you've kind of already played it before. So how these two are going to be mixing together is just like what you've seen in the Fire Team Dirty Bomb. So if you mix a bit of Fire Team Dirty Bomb and a bit of Warzone together, you're going to be getting the brand new Warzone, and that is exactly how it's going to be played out. Yes, Warzone is running slightly older and Black Ops is running slightly new, but you're still going to be playing on that slightly older kind of style, that slower, that tone down kind of style of gameplay, but with the kind of fast pace of the Black Ops, how we like it. It's quite a confusing one to get your head around, but let's just put it this way. Once these two games get put together, it's going to be a lot of fun. It doesn't really matter what it looks like from an outsider's point of view, just know this. Once these two get put together, it is going to be amazing. So, you're probably wondering, is the map going to be changing? Well, yes, the map is going to be changing. And how is it going to be changing? Well, it's been rumoured for such a long time that this map is going to get nuked. And guess what? This map is going to get nuked. So, they're going to be bringing in the Black Ops Cold War map into Warzone. So, basically, everything new is going into the old crating and old new system something like that anyway but either way it's going to be a lot of fun so it is going to be the same gameplay as you see in warzone just with a new map so as we all know as as we know from the leaks and all the rumors and everything that's been going on right now the warzone map as it is right now will get nuked whether it will be a standalone map by itself so we might have the original warzone map and the uh, like another Warzone map, just like we saw in a Black Ops World, because we saw the Blackout, and then we saw Alcatraz, that was two maps, that wasn't just one. So they might do the same there and keep it as the Warzone original map and the Black Ops Cold War map. So make sure you leave all your thoughts down in the comment section. This one is a bit of a weird one to get your head around, but just know this. This game is going to be fun either way. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave all your thoughts down in the comment section below. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching, guys. And I'm out. Peace.